Here we go, here we go. Alright. Hey everybody. Rock! Ingrid! Hey, 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 hey! How we doing? Alright, so I made a ton of notes. And had some success yesterday. Hey Bruce, how you doing buddy? Had some success yesterday doing my normal Chinese menu option here where I'm watching a whole bunch of different approaches and uh, um, ways to play the holes and picking the ones I think they're going to work best for me. So hopefully I made the right choices, eh? All right, so this is the... Uh, this is the Tartan Rainbow account, I believe. Otherwise known as Junior. Yeah. Okay, that's the one it is. So, I got my notes. I got my app. I got everything, and I got some folks watching. So, I guess we're about ready to go, eh? So, uh, on the first one, we're going to play with a sniper. We're going to play 25% max with uh, Kingmaker. So, I'm going to make sure that is all set up. Do, 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 do. Do, do, be, do, be, do, do. Okay. See if we can pull this off, eh? Of course. <laughs> Hitting perfect is the key. Yesterday I shot 14 on my main account. Could have been 17, because the adjustments are right, but I had some greats in there that would have dropped had I hit perfect. So, that being said, I hit one, two, and six yesterday, so. I'm feeling better, and I had a uh, talk with the doc today, he did a telehealth thing. Okay, here we go. All right. 8 oh, so that's 10-2. All right, so what we're going to do is get that up there, pull it all the way back, and 5 right. All right. So we want this in the fringe. Like, nope, too far over. There we go. Just like that. All right. And then we're going to pull 10 2. Get it lined up. It hit perfect, so let's see how it comes in. Get in the hole. Oh, son of a gun, man. Ah, so close. Makes me wish I hit great left. Very, very close. All right, so we'll take the birdie on the first one. And that's okay. Meantime, we're going to get set up for hole two because we don't play shootout holes. Don't have time for that nonsense. Uh, I am healing up, Ingrid, but I'm still not getting a lot of sleep here. So I had to talk with the doctor today, did telehealth, and uh, we're going to add muscle relaxers to the mix, and hopefully that will get me... Um, Because the part of the pain is from the muscles tensing up and being in like when I'm sleeping, I don't really move around a lot, so they're kind of like in knots, and it takes a while to relax them out. So we're hoping that that'll be the solution. That was like really, really close. So, and that's okay, man. That means we're on the right track, right? When we're that damn close, on the right track. Uh, other people are playing it different ways. Uh, this is one I got off uh, 
the uh, expert hole one. And I sunk it last night, so. Mrs. Wood just came into the house. Oh, Hi, I'm Mrs. Leaving Wood. Again. Are you? Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. That Kevin said if we ever do our yard. All right, you still got that 20 for Mama? Oh, my goodness. Do you? <laughs> but how are you going to take my money? Ginger Jordy, how you doing? It's our money, dear. If I never have cash on me, oh, yeah. you say give cash on me. Right, but I, I forgot that he was coming and I didn't have time to stop, so. Or I would have stopped. Actually. <laughs> not that I didn't have time, I didn't think about it. So, so you fuss at me over it, I get the cash and now you're just going to take not even 24 will take hours. it and you can get some more later. Oh my God. It's not like I'm taking the twenty dollars and saying you can't have any more. It's our money, not your money, not my money. So it doesn't matter. What's mine's yours, and what's yours is mine. Well, anyway, I was busy talking. So I didn't notice I was in the shootout here. So let me get out of this. He was too busy taking my money. Whose money? My money. Yeah, okay. $20. Okay. If you like, I'll go get you some more money so you feel better, okay? Just pay the lawn guy. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Actually, one of us has got to go out and get your medicine anyway in a bit. Right, and that's right there at Walgreens, so. Very good, honey. Very good. Much better than my Sam today. You're funny. I want you to treat me like your special ed students. Rick O, how you doing, buddy? Shut. Hi, Rick O. Rick O, yeah. Quarks. Hey, my buddy Quarks. How you doing, buddy? Um, okay, so hole two is going to be uh, Thor's Hammer 7 with the Kingmaker. All right, we're playing five top, two right, putting it down the middle. And my target yard is just P358 and 360. Because I have the Thorn slider percentages for 358, 359, and 360. All right. GC India is freaking awesome, Anger. Did you just discover him? I go over here and look at his stuff, too. Why are you throwing money at me? Well, because he stops and gets it from you, so. Well, I thought you were going to pay him. That's okay. I'll take care of it. Where are you going? I'm going back over to Ann's. Okay. Have fun. I am. Stay over there for a while, will I you? I will. Oh, I probably should check my email and make sure I didn't have We finally have an opponent. Yeah, GC India puts out some really, really good content. Yeah, he puts out really excellent content. I am a sub of his already, and I go in there, and that's part of the guys uh, that I pick. Um, uh, that I pick uh, different holes from when I do my Chinese menu on my notes, figuring out which way he plays best for me. So, do uh, anybody go into expert hole six and look at Robert's adjustment from Min? Hey, McDilson, how you doing? Oh, <laughs> we're thanks for the good luck. Where you start at min, figure out how many rings you need to push up, whatever the ring adjustment is, make your spin adjustment there, and then pull it back to min. I tried that last night and got the Albi. So we're going to try that again today and see if it works again. So, all right, so we're going to basically, to be in the middle, we need the blue ring by the rough. All right. And we're going three, four, five. No more than five because we don't want to be in the bunker. But we do want to be in our target range. 8-3 is 8-1. I have to push it rather than pull it because of the rocks. All right. Perfect hit. John B. Terry McCauley. Wow, man. All my friends are showing up today. That is flipping awesome, man. That is great. 360. Okay, 360 is 10% uh, on the thorn. Minus 10. At 10% on the slider. 
And you wouldn't think it makes a difference, but it does. If you play it at min, you will miss. You cannot play this at min. The uh, yellow ring will be on the uh, fringe line. I appreciate y'all being here. I really, really do. I saw that Graham was on. I went over and checked him out, but he really, he, I thought he was playing expert, but he wasn't. He was just grinding away. And then Toast is on, but he's doing pro. And Jesse's premiere, I got in at the tail end of that, so. And I just missed that. And I think he was doing rookie. So, let's see if I can hit this thing now. Got my slider all set and everything. So it's going to be 2-5. Now. Need one backspin, but you might need a little right spin to avoid the glitch. Ah, uh, come on, man. Or a little left spin. Let's see which way it goes. Damn glitch, man. I don't want it to stop short. All right, I'm running out of time, so I gotta play this. Hit perfect, so hopefully it does not stop short. Oh, hell no, I hit the glitch anyway, didn't I? Son of a biscuit! So, so far, I have not done anything. But that's okay, I've gotten close. I couldn't find the line. I couldn't find the side line. It kept being glitchy on me. Should have moved it a little bit, I suppose. And it's okie dokie smoky because this is only qualifying. And here we're just finding stuff out. Right? So all we're trying to do is find stuff out. I do like to dunk whenever possible. All right, man, listen to this music, getting happy feet. So my wife takes off, leaves me $20 that I did ask her for, but to pay the long guy. So no doubt he's going to come knocking on the door and the dogs are going to go crazy right in the middle of my, one of my shots, I'm sure. Okay, so we wish him good luck and we go. All right. Now, I believe I'm set up for the next one. Where I can get up there and not go over. I know a lot of people are playing quarterback. I think I have the rock set up. I'm not sure. Let me look. I do. Okay, so this is going to be rock and kingmaker. No, anyway, I just got to set up. Uh, make sure my app is correct. Okay, now with a rock, mm, with a rock like this, rock playing a rock. Eric Curse, thank you for being here, man. Appreciate it. I hope I did not miss anybody. Okay. Um, I have a note here because I did go too far before. I only want like 2.2 top. Because anything else, you're in danger of going into the rough. And we don't want that. Now, okay, so some advice from Victoria. Give me let me second. Give me a second, Vic. And I'll look. Okay, so. I better land on the green just in front of the fringe. Okay, so the uh, the glitches from being on the fringe is what you're saying. Okay. All right, I'm going to try that because I try to keep an open mind. The only way to get better is to pay attention to what other people do and see what works for you. Yep, cancer-free. I was on the, on the, I did telehealth with the, with a, a GP for follow-up after the surgeon. It was some kind of inflammation of cells where it kind of like made a cyst by surrounding whatever the inflammation was. They have no idea. They've done all kinds of tests. They have no idea what the original infection was from. Okay? So, still more tests, tests, and more tests. Alright, so we want to be right over the shadow there. We're doing one right. And like 2.2 top. There we go. 8.7. Max at 10% is 9.9. 
So all we're trying to do is get up there. Without going over. Karen, welcome. Welcome, honey. Thanks for being here. That should get us up nice and close. Yeah, probably go 2-5. I know 2-8 and 3 is too much, so... So I am not, I am cancer free, but I am not pain free because when they went in there, they spread the ribs in my back, you know, and they cut nerves and muscle and it's just like, it's healing and it's healing very, very well, but it's still a pain all the time. Oh, you're funny, Eric. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling you what, I was, I was bunged up uh, the first four days after the operation because of all the pain meds. <laughs> and I could not take it. I, could, I did not have a bowel movement, man. It just got to the point where nothing was going out, so I could put nothing in. I lost my appetite completely. Oh, it was it was painful. Finally got it loosened up enough for day five. Day five. And now I'm regular again, so no longer full of shit, Eric. Okay? <laughs> That's hilarious, man. Okay. 8-5 at 10, at 10 six is going to be, okay, we want all the top and as much side as we can get. That is going to be 9-6. We'll, we will add just a little baby curl on it, but it's not really necessary. But I do it just in case a great right. Because I don't want to end up in the rough there. Okay, so this is going to be like zero elevation on the thorn. And I'm pretty much going to go. No, so Eric, you know what I'm talking about, man. It's the pain meds that lock you up, man. It's the pain meds that lock you up. You want them because you don't want to feel the pain. But my God, they just, you're so bound up, man. My my lower abdomen was like a rock. <laughs> hey, oh, thanks, Eric. I know a lot of people were praying for me, man, all around the place. I mean, my cousin has a prayer group at her church. They were praying. Everybody in my family, a lot of people here in the Golf golf Clash community were praying for me. Um, at work and in the community here. It was really nice to know that a lot of people cared enough to do that. And I do appreciate it. Yeah, there is a funnel here if you can find it. And then you have to know also exactly where you're at on, on your club. Otherwise, it don't work. I give it a brief look to see if I can find it. Usually, it's like no spin or a little spin, to very little spin to get it. Okay, so there's men. There's Max. We'll try this. 9-1 at max. 5-2. I've hit the funnel in pro. So I have no compunction about trying it. We do hit perfect, so let's see. <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> Three back, two left. Very close to mid. Well, a little late on that. John Bell, welcome there, man. Uh. Boomer, my friend. Thank you. Hi, Sandy. So, yeah, you know, it is it is what it is. We're going to take the birdie here and then go from here. This is going to be like a, a no-chip chip. Uh, screw all that. That is not working. We'll take the wind out as much as possible, but... Great left shouldn't hurt. Yeah. Bottom right of the green is where you set your marker. You will find the funnel then. Okay, good. Good to know. Let me find that. 
Let me might mark that down. Okay, so funnel. We're looking for bottom right green. And you say it's going to play around mid, right? All right. And I think... What would you say, Eric? Three back, two left? All right. So I made a note of that. So that'll remind me next time I come through, right? Which won't be today. It'll be Thursday. But I got... Uh, Plenty of uh, time to look at. It. Okay, I got you, buddy. I got you. All right. So, hole four. Oh, so has anybody tried the send it shot? Let me turn that down. Anybody tried the send it shot here with the APOC? Because I've seen that in... Um, I saw that... And I think Sith Legion had it in there. Where are my units? No, no, it wasn't there. Are the hole hunters? Ah, I hate it when I when I have something, but then I can't remember where the hell I saw it. You know. I know there's a send it shot. Uh, what do you guys think? Should I send it? Okay, Eric. There is a send it shot. I know there's one in, uh, Hole four expert. So a lot of people rinsing their balls. <laughs> but uh, there is an APOC five with a kingmaker. It's just all the left, no back. Uh, with uh, and the mark is just off the shoreline, about a ring. If you get too close to the shoreline, you do get wet. You're just sucking on that shot. Okay. Send it, send it, send it, send it, send it, send it, send it. Okay. Was that you, Rot, that said that send it? Put, you put your poster. I was just in the Sith Lords. I did not see it. Was it you I told it was going to try it? I hate to hold up the... Oh, I found it, Scott. It was, a, uh, was it Apocalypse 5, too, right? Because somebody got a hole in one doing it this way. And where were you moving? 18 rings? Or did you go full 20? Nah, that looks like 17. Looks like 17. No top, no side, right? Just, uh, I mean, no top, no back. Just all side. I'm looking at it now. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not looking at the chat. I'm looking at it now. Your white ring was just barely off the shoreline. Yeah, he caught that nice patch right there. It goes right on up. Oh, that's the hole in one shot. That's the hole in one shot. Was that you that did that? It was APOC 5. Yeah, APOC, APOC 5. I said, okay, you know what? We're going to do it with the... Uh, we're going to try it because I don't care. 
because if we fail, since I did not get the eagle on uh, on uh, one or two, I got nothing to lose here because I got another day of qualifying if it don't work, right? Somebody say Dr. Devo's in the house? Hey, he is. Hey, what's up, buddy? Oh, yeah. All left, no top, no back. Right. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Ugh. It sounds like I got another freaking video going in there. Oh, it's the same video replaying. Yeah, initially you were too far offshore, I think, and then you moved it back a little bit. This was, uh, oh, Energy. It wasn't yours. It was a guy named Energy from the SmackDown. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go. Lord have mercy on us. It was an 8.6 win, but with a Kingmaker, this win should be similar. With 8.6, you use quarter top. So, and it's just off the shoreline, right? If I remember correctly from looking at all the videos, the people that missed had the white ring up on the shoreline, and then they went too far left, and they ended, and they ended up getting wet. And the people that... Uh, that stayed offshore either went onto the green or into the rough behind the green. That's what I remember seeing. From, I mean, I watched a ton of those. Yeah, this is my third Devo. I shot 11, then I shot 14 on the main. Say, so look at that. Water! This is 7-3. I might need a little bit of top. 7-3. I'm going to put one top on it, guys. Hoping you're agreeing there. This is where I'm seeing it right there. I hope that's right. I hope I'm not too far left. Oh, I was I was too far right. I was too far right. That was a much lower win though. You know, how you doing buddy? Thanks for the good luck. Yeah, that didn't work. I also saw somebody do this with a power five ball. It's kind of not necessary. I did have a second shot lined up for playing it the normal way. 370's mid thorn with one to two back. He's getting wet again, isn't he? <laughs> too far the other way. <laughs> yeah, there's not enough wind for that one. Even with a one top spin, it, could, it couldn't clear the rough line. All right, where are we here? That's max, so about, I don't know, two-thirds. Eh, about. Two-thirds is four-five. Seventy percent is four-seven, so it's going to be close. We're going to go with the two-thirds. Probably not the best landing position either, but... We'll see. Oh, no. I was way off. Boom, you need a haircut. Come on up here. I'll give you a haircut. Come on to my place, dude. Uh, I'm thinking see this was uh, hole four right if I don't ace hole five this becomes a practice round but I'm not going to forfeit yet
You know, tens are making the cut, right? And uh, I don't know if anybody anybody else agrees or not, but since three is not a given on the eagle, if you're going for the albatross and miss, uh, I believe 11 is par for this course. And Sandy, I'm feeling better. I just, I just don't get enough sleep. I just don't get enough sleep and I get tired easy. But you know, this healing, doctor said I'm healing fine. Right, right like I'm supposed to. So it's just a matter of time. It's all, it's time, you know? All right, so now this one, I got a grizzly. I don't know if I have a grizzly in here. I do not. Okay, we got to go out. Hang on. I want to open that anyway. Forgot all about it. I was supposed to do that after hole one. Then I might have another one behind it. See? Yeah. All right, let's go to the uh, rock one. We'll go ahead and make that a uh, grizzly. I'm going to go ahead and change this to quarterback because I'm going to need that for hole, uh, what was it, seven later on a shot there. So we'll go ahead and I don't know if I'm using Thor's hammer again. But uh, Grizzly's the one for this shot. Let me see if I got a uh, power two wind ball. That's power one, right? Yeah. That power three. Oh, that's not one. I don't think that is. Oh, it is. Okay, we'll use it up. We'll get rid of it. We just want to see anyway. Okay, power two wind ball. Power two in the app. We're playing this 25% uh, mid. Okay. Yeah, hole two is hole two is a must eagle. Yeah, but it's not guaranteed, Diva. I'm stuck. Uh, you can disagree, but I think 11's par. Anything, anything over 11 is a drop. Yeah, my wife and daughter, Sandy, were doing each other's hair. And my, my wife's doing her mother's hair. Mm. Yeah, but now everybody's got that dialed in. I mean, you're talking about this. I mean, as large as the 19th community is, it's still a pretty small community compared to the amount of people that play the game. Hey, Vic, thanks, man. I appreciate you coming in, man. All right, so we're going to try this shot. This is a... Uh, uh, anyway. So anyway, what we're trying to do, if I can remember, how oh, you guys got me all... I get distracted easily. That's my ADHD kicking in, man. Ha, <laughs> ha, uh, Where is that damn thing? All right. So if I remember, I'm trying to remember what the spins were, because we're lining up the spins to it, but. Oh my God. Yeah, we're lining up the spins to the hole and then playing 25%, so we'll see. You're yeah, very close. Unless, let me check the chat real quick. Yeah. Adam Tinker. Hey, man. Thanks for being here, dude. Appreciate it. Ugh. Back starting to bother me again. Mm. Son of a gun. There's about 20 different approaches to this hole. I haven't seen anybody mm, replicate over and over again. So, of course, I have still yet to look at uh, Fenzel and Danimal Stream, which I plan on doing tomorrow in preparation for opening round on Thursday. All right, so I'm trying to find. Okay. Give me a little bit more white. No, damn it. Get lined up to the whole rock. All right, six one mid to seven one. Basically, one to one plus one. Hopefully, I pulled that right. I don't even know. And hit great right, so that was a fuck off all the way around, wasn't it? 
Look at that. Ah, there's a cluster fuck all the way around. Ah, oh, jeez. It's hard to play this game when your back hurts like mine does. That's why I was real happy with my 14 yesterday, man. I'm feeling it a little bit. Ugh. Might be time to pop some pain meds, man. Just mellow out. Hey. <laughs> uh, okay. Last chance on six. And no Albi. Oh, yeah, we are playing Thor's Hammer, aren't we? Yeah. What the fuck music have I got on there? Jig, jag, jag. What the hell is that? Shut up. Yeah, I had, I had some other stuff that was supposed to come up in the freaking thing. And it didn't. Ah, bastard. Put on the Swamp Blues. Look at this. I wasn't even paying attention to what he did. He's playing the Grizzly. I think he did what I was trying to do. Oh, no. Hell no. How did he hit good? He hit good and got a hole in one, really? Wow. 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 He hit good. I don't know if he did it on purpose or not. He hit good and got a hole in one, man. Yeah, literally, Devo, good shot. <laughs> mother, mother, butts of breasts of rest of mother. Holy crap. Suck to be me on that hole. Wow. Okay. Here we go. Thor's hammer. 20%. Five top. Five top, four left. Yeah, that was lucky, man. <laughs> yeah, he hit good. Literally hit good. He did not hit perfect. I, I looked up and the ball was going in the hole because I was working on something else. So I went quickly and looked at the uh, YouTube studio because it, uh, it had the delay. And I'm watching him. And I thought he had it all lined up. And then he hit good and it, and it flipping goes in the hole. I'm like, what the hell? What the hell, man? Finally got a, finally got an opponent. Well, you know what? Even a blind squirrel finds a nut once in a while. That squirrel cock. <laughs> uh, okay, so. I hit the obby on this yesterday by trying Robert's uh, adjustment in uh, whole six expert chat. Where he pulled it back to men, figured out what his win rings, win per ring was, how many rings he had to move up, Right? So I think it was 7.4. I moved up 7.4 rings. Then I adjusted my spin to the hole. One like one square in front. And then I pulled right back to man. Hit perfect. It went in the hole. Dead center. He's done it three times doing it that way. So I'm going to see if I can replicate it again today. I don't know. Oh. <clears throat> Not too concerned about hitting perfect on the drive. This is great right, great left proof. Uh, the way I set it up. I don't like the middle drive. Never have. Never will. Too much danger. Danger, Will Robinson. You know what I mean? All right. Five and four. See, I'm right down here in the center. That's where I want to be. Yeah, the adjustment is eight rings. We do our best to hit perfect. And we do. This comes in a very nice range here. 
378. All right, so uh, the second adjustment is um, 15%, not 10 as you might think. It's 15% min on the uh, next shot. Now, the only difference is Robert plays 10% on the drive, 15 on the second. I play 20% on the drive and 15 on the second. All right. Boomer, quit eating them damn cashews. You hear me? Quit eating them damn cashews. <laughs> All right. So you'll see how I do this. And we'll see if it works, if I can get it to work again. The first thing I do is get the wind. 7-7. Seven, seven. So my min is going to be 7-1. I just need to find min. All right, there's min. So then that is 7-1. I'm a little bit further in front of the hole than I want to be, but that's okay. And we hit perfect, so let's see if this works. If it goes in, I stay. If it doesn't, it's a practice round. Son of a biscuit. I just missed it. All right, practice round. I'm not going to turn in an 11, man. Screw this. Tater top, man. How you feeling today, Sean? You feeling good, man? Worried about you, dude. Uh, you know what? I don't even know. Do I want to make it a practice round and play this shit again tomorrow? Or do I want to All right, there's three holes left. There might still be plenty of time to tank the round. I don't know. I'm not real happy with the results so far, though. Because it's been birdies up till now. That's the first bloody eagle is on hole six, and that's not good. We're going to try the uh, Daniel MacArthur shot, funnel shot, on uh, this one next. We are not practicing it because we do not have... In the right club. Take a look at that seven. See where that puts us. All right, dude. But anytime you need to talk, man, you can hit me up, dude. Okay? Anytime. So that puts us 12th. Nineteenth goat farms in here. Big jock. Ugh. So 14 is the lead in the Indian Stallions. Stallions. Everybody else is at 11, and I'm on pace for 11. It would be nice to get a drop. I don't anticipate getting one on 8, that's for sure. Or 9, for that matter. Um, this next hole is actually my, my last best chance to get a flipping drop. And we're going to try the funnel. Okay, so this is played at... Um, Minus five, Max. Thank you, dear. I thought you were over next door. I am either way. Okay. With Kingmaker. All right. So let's see. Got a lot of love for you, Tater Tot, man. So even though you're an asshole sometimes. <laughs> but, uh, dude, you need to talk. You just let me know.
Really? Y'all give her Karen crap because she don't have a wrench? I can fix that real real quick, you know. Alright. Uh, 8-0 is going to be 7-4. Where's that one yard mark? Alright. A half a top and one left. There it is. Okay, so I need 7.4. There we go. Can we hit perfect? We can. <clears throat> Get in the hole. Oh, ain't that some shit. If you give Karen a wrench, I'm going to unsub. Really, Boomer? Really? That sucks, Boomer. It was nice knowing you, dude. Can't believe you said that. Karen's so nice. Karen, you now have a wrench. That was, I hand those wrenches out like candy, so. Can't believe this flipping, that shot did not go in. I'm so pissed. I think it needs a little bit more than half a top. Because it's coming up short. That's the second time it came up short of the hole for me. I pulled a huge 1159. No, dude, I was just trying to pull. Do you think that's why I came up short? I have to go back and review, but... No, it wasn't planned. I'm so flipping tired of this shit right now. Yeah. Okay, D Mac pulled eleven fifty nine. Hit it three fucking times. So why didn't I hit it? Because I think it's more than a half a top. I mean, he has half top there, but that's that's what Kimmy said. Half top, one left. And I come up, sh I came up short twice. Now I gotta watch my sub button and see if it goes down one. Uh, I'm so I'm so aggravated at this point. I don't even care. Cause nothing's falling. But you know, yeah, you know, we all have days like that, man. You know, it's, it's crap, but we all have days like that. You know. Oh, if you don't give Karen a wrench, okay. Well, I gave her a wrench. I thought that was being pretty petty of you, and that didn't seem like you, Boomer. Yeah, my speaking spell sucks too, man. Every time I say I, it says hi. And it puts the word O in there all the time, and I never even say O, but it puts it in there all the time. All right, so this is ascended. I don't know if I want. I don't want the wind resistance. I'm probably just going to have to go ahead and use the berserker. In the other accounts, I had a rock ball. I already know where the aim point is, so. You went two for two, and hey. You're still at 13, buddy. As long as you don't, as long as you don't muck it up too bad. As long as you get your birdies and eagles on the rest of the par fives. 13 is nothing to sneeze at. I would love to have a 13 right here, but it doesn't seem like it's going to happen. I'm going to be right over that lamp post. Four. Four. 
<laughs> Look at that big ass bounce, man. <laughs> Stay on the fairway. Stay on the fairway, baby. Okay. Now we got a shot at an eagle here. How'd y'all like that shot? Yeah, fourth on the edge of four on the edge of the cup. All right, so this is going to be zero elevation, I believe, and I might it might be a rapier shot. I'm that damn close. I don't know if it's going to be rapier or oh crap! I don't have a thorn in this bag. I got a I got a flipping hornet. Ugh. Sandbagger, thanks, man. I appreciate the for the good luck, and I hope I'm feeling better too. Hey, you like that drive, huh? That was a flipping awesome drive, man. The lamppost is the key. It's a lot better than ending up where he did. And you had that big ass flipping bounce. Sometimes it goes in the uh, thing. Yeah, there's. Look at that. Freaking. Okay, so you know what? I'm lined up with the wind. I think I can play this at min if I just move up six rings. And line it up with a hole. Line that up with the wind. Pull it back to min. And just hit perfect. Hit perfect. It should go in. Get in the hole! Son of a bitch! Uh, I can't believe that didn't go, man. I lined that up with the wind. Did the right ring pull. Zero elevation, six rings. I am missing right. What the hell? Motherfucker. Oh. I can't believe that, man. That was so much fucking bullshit. I don't see how that missed. Vito, you got a wrench. <clears throat> Eric, you got a wrench too, man. I don't care. Everybody can have a wrench. I don't give a crap. I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that didn't go in. How does that miss right? Did I pull it funny or something? Did I not pull it correctly? Fuck me. All right. Pardon my language. I get upset with that stupid shit, man. That really pisses me off. All right. Okay, so. You look at this right here. <coughs> I can tank the next one and I'm out. And play again tomorrow. Because you'll be sure one of these three below me are definitely going to get above me. Right? Nobody below me I have to worry about. Right? But this guy's definitely, he's going to definitely try to qualify. He's definitely trying to qualify. He's definitely trying to qualify. So I don't know. What do you think? You need to see a replay? We'll play the replay, man. Because I think, I, that was, I thought I did everything right, man. I found out what the what the min was on that. In the meantime, you guys have your opinions whether I should tank, tank the, uh, tank the round now, or uh, and play again tomorrow. If I don't, I'll be forfeit. Yeah, that's pretty much it, isn't it? That's what that's what I'm thinking. Because I'm doing a Sunday shot with the freaking Thor's Hammer Seven that I almost have, almost have lined up. Not quite, almost. It's very close to ended up in the fairway. Okay, so look. You see where the wind is, right? I move up six rings. I 
I got none but backspin on it. No side. That looks to me like a noon pull. And that's straight back six. Six rings. Just the same as what I pushed up. And I hit perfect. And yet it misses right of the pin. Like, majorly right. Yeah, I know they're tougher tomorrow. I ain't worried about it, though, because... I won't stream this tomorrow. Probably. I might. I don't know. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter whether I stream or not. Hang on. My wife's regaling me with a little bit of gossip. So, oh, let's open the free chest. I think we might go straight into the pro account after this. Uh, you know what? Oh, yeah. I see a little slight OP, but that should should have made that much difference, Doc Devo, because I was smack dab in the middle of the cup. Yeah, and the fringe is slightly sloped to the left. So, I don't know. If it did go higher up, it may have caused it to go further right. Yeah. That win, it didn't make any sense for it not to go in. I thought that was I thought that was a gimme. Even, to be quite honest with you, I thought if I hit great left or right, it would still go in the hole. Being it was that close at men with a freaking, with a hornet. With a hornet. So, yeah, even with a little low piece, I still don't think it should have missed. The mother should have underpowered it. Well, what was I doing? Anybody remember what the hell I was doing? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. I'll make sure I'm set up here. Alright. On this one, I do need... Well, I do. I carry the Spitfire just in case. I don't like carrying the Amazon, even though it's got that much more top spin, because sometimes you have a shot at the pin with the Nirvana, and the Nirvana is a better one to have, you know? Nirvana's the best one to have, so so we're just going to change out to the uh, Spitfire there instead of the Malibu in case we catch sand, but alright and the hole moved <laughs> that was minus 5 max minus 5 according to what um, Kimmy put in the notes yeah, PD fuckery that's what I call it Tournament shenanigans, all that shit. Well, I should dump the round after that because I should have got that damn eagle. I am highly tempted to, but we are we are still gonna play hole nine. Yeah, because look at that. I mean, we got we got three players behind us that can definitely go in front of us on hole eight. So, you know, damn. Okay, let's just play our let's just play our par five here. See if I can get that lined it up. So is what true? Oh, boom. oh, is what true? Oh, will they move the holes? Yeah, they move the fucking holes. They move a point one left, point one, point one right. The whole new meaning to the expression "no moving target." Uh, my target moves. <laughs> I want to play no moving target because my damn target moves. Ugh, what the hell music have they got me going in here now? They keep changing it on me, man. They're pissing me off. Shut up. That's better. I put right curl on this to avoid doing what he just did. Although I do end up like around 486 or so with the Thor's Hammer 7. But uh, you can put all the top, two left, two right, because that's all I can freaking get out of it. 10 2. I want to end up right in that. 
area. And then I'm putting as much right curl on as, well, almost. Yeah, it's all the right curl. And hit perfect, because I want to see where it ends up. I've done different degrees of curl. It's the first time with all the right. Well, damn, almost made it over that damn cliff, didn't I? So, to get to the fairway on the left there, I don't need all the right. Probably bring it back. Bring it back to the in, uh, the uh, left side of the ball to the inner uh, inner ring. That almost made it over. Damn, that would have been a beauty of a shot if that made it over that. That would have been a beauty of a shot, man. All right, so no elevation on the second shot. We're going to try to get the Albi with the uh, Nirvana. Yeah, if it made it over that uh, rock pile, that would have set up a beautiful Alba chance. Yeah, it's an easy eagle, usually, after this. Okay, we're at max there. And that's zero club there. Which is, that's pretty much where I want to be. Okay. All right, so I can put this zero power in the app. Makes it 8-2. So that either, that either means I'm going to adjust it perfectly. Or it's going in a trap. Then we hit perfect. See if there's any PD fuckery going on with this one. You motherfucker. You believe that? My ball guy was to the hole. And I was online to that and it just died. It's old man nap time? Nobody told me, Boomer. Oh, it's 3.30. It is old man nap time. Okay. Fuck this and forfeit. Go back to eight, and we will give it a shot tomorrow. Give that boy his eagle. That should take us right out of the running, and it does. Okay, so we'll play this again tomorrow. All right, so look, this is what I'm going to do, folks, because I have to do my pro stream separate, and I'm going to. Um, if you want to come back on for that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to kill this stream and then immediately start another one with uh, pro, okay? Okay. So, um, I hope that you will come and join me for that, all right? Thanks, everybody, for being here. Give me 60 seconds. Pro stream, come right back up.